Hi, this is our vendor demo for using when using Hopin as the platform. When you enter a Canadian Small Business Women event on Hopin, you are going to be welcomed in the reception area. You know you're in the reception area if you look to the left hand side and you see that highlighted section reception. There's also a sessions tab and an expo tab. Typically, there will be two other tabs here, one for networking and the other will be for the main stage. For this particular example, we are only going to go through what it looks like for the expo tab so you can see what a vendor booth looks like. So I'm going to click visit expo and we're going to wait for that to load. And here is what the outside of a vendor booth looks like. You see here, these three booths are large booths. And then here we have medium sized booths. There is also the option for small booths, which are half the size of medium sized booths. Now, when you look at a booth, you can see that there are many variations. People usually like having their products as part of their background image because it entices people to enter their booths. So let me show you an example of what the inside of a booth looks like. So this is the exterior of a large booth. Here you find the background image, then here you find the logo. Here is your business name, and then you have a tagline that you would enter under the business name. Now when someone comes to shop, they will click on your booth, and once they click on your booth, they will be able to enter your booth. In your booth, you will have a video option, either via YouTube, Vimeo, or Wistia. And that would have a preloaded, it's a preloaded video that we can play whenever we enter the actual booth. Now, the other option is to go live in the booth. And when you want to go live, you have this toggle button here. So if you toggle to go live, it will prompt you here to share your audio and video. So we're prompted to share our audio and video. We are going to share our audio and video. Hi, and now you can see me. So I am currently sharing my audio and I'm sharing my video. And if you look here, it will say that there are three people, two people watching, and it will say one of 10 people are on video. You can invite up to 10 people, well, including yourself, to be on video with you. And you can also use the share screen option here to share your screen if there are any presentations or any videos that you would like to share. Here would be your options to turn off your sound and turn off your video. And once you turn off your video and your sound, this will be what everyone sees. So I always say it's best to have some kind of screen being shared with a message of some sort if you're going to turn off the video or you toggle back so that you are back to having that preloaded video for everyone to see. The other section of your booth is here. So this is where all your social media uh, handles are. This is also where your long description is for your booth. And this is where your button is for people to go to your website to either find out more, to purchase a product, anything of the sort. The other important section is your booth chat box. This is where you interact with people who visit your booth. The booth poll this is also where you can poll the people who come to your booth. So hopefully this helps you when applying for a vendor event so you can get an idea of what the inside and the outside of the booth looks like at a CSBW event. Thank you.